settled on top of the box. Great play to get it away initially. Now fired on net, but there's Allie White making the save. Now on for Riley. Out in front. White comes out and is able to block it away. Now it's kicked well out of the way. Valera, the tallest girl in the pile as this ball swings in. Initially punched away. Maxudi races after it. Up top. Swift fires it. Scores! Fordham has taken the lead with 9.57 to go in the first half. Swift with a top-of-the-box blast makes it 1-0. McDonald, ball goes back. Carbolera tried to head it back to McDonald, and now it's going to be launched from distance. Racing after it is McDonald. She fires it on net right in front. Warden can't get it in. Is it in? Yes, it is. Warden scores her first of the season, 5.58 to go in the first half. Rams by two. The forward line couldn't do it. Is how many minutes that this Fairfield team has had to play. Carbolera sends it through onside. This is Warden. Right foot shot. Score. The Rams have taken a 3-0 lead with 33-22 to go in the second half. And haven't been able to find a goal at all. As this ball played forward. Sayez nearly knocks this ball into her own net. Maxudi scores! Christina Maxudi breaks her drought. She scores here. It is 4-0 Fordham with 31-27 to go in the second half. Badgering popped into the air over the area. It's going to be bouncing out in front, trying to take a shot. Nice save, Soother. It's going to roll across goal line extended. Shot came in from Pedersen, and Soother tested early. Comes up big with the save. Eight, Seconds to go in the seven, second half. 4-1 four, four, Fordham. Five, four, and the victory three, bell will ring two, on Rose Hill tonight. One. The Rams a 4-1 winner as the final whistle blows. The Rams come away with a win here. They go to 3-6. and six. Fairfield falls to 3-3-2. Three, three, and two. The one-on-one -on -one postgame report comes up right now. We're here with sophomore Maria Swift following the Rams 4-1 win over Fairfield. Maria coming into the game, you guys only had three goals offensively, come out with an explosion tonight with four goals. Talk about the game tonight. Um, I mean, we haven't scored in a while, so it felt good to score four goals in one game. Um, I mean, Ness always said that once we score one goal, they don't, they're all going to keep coming, so it's pretty cool that actually happened tonight. You score the opening goal of the game, your first career goal. Talk a little bit about the goal. Um, all right, well, it was a corner kick. It came back out, and Tina passed it to me, and I shot it on the ground into the far corner. Really put a little bit of mustard behind that, too. Uh, <laughs> I don't think the goalie really had much of a chance on that one. Was that something that you guys had kind of talked about, making sure to get away shots very, very quickly and put some pace on it? Yeah, uh, Ness has been saying a lot that we have to follow through with our shot, and so we've been practicing that a lot lately, so yeah. We're here with senior Annie Warden following the Rams' 4-1 to win over Fairfield. Annie pick up two goals tonight to lead the offensive attack. What was the difference in, in tonight's match? You guys really found a, a little bit of a groove there offensively. I think um, before the game, you know, we came in really positive. Uh, we had a really good locker room talk. And the second that Swift scored that nice, calm goal, we all settled down and things started to work out. Talk about the, I believe it was the the first goal, the long pass from Carbolera. Talk about kind of what was going through there and kind of how that play developed. You know, I, that's the position that I play as a faster forward. It's looking constantly for those breaks. And the second that I got it, Tina said, go, you're open. And that's exactly what I did. <laughs> Obviously, you guys come away with the opening win of the weekend. You got Loyola on Sunday. What do you have to do to keep this uh, momentum going from tonight's game? I, we definitely have to take the energy into the next game and believe that we can do it again and again and again, which I think that we do. All right, well, thanks, Annie, and congrats on the win. Thank you.